Hello guys, good morning. Hello, hello, hello. How are you? I hope you're well. Sorry about the music in the last episode. It was a little bit up and down, wasn't it? It's making me a little bit seasick. Um, so yeah, apologies for that. I've adjusted it. Hopefully it'll sound better today. We'll see. We'll have to see. Right, what have we got here? Um, Chef Hyperlight wants me to attract the attention of the Michelin Guide. He wants to do that still. And she wants me to create five new platings for five different dishes and use them as default platings. Right. So to do that, we're going to have to change the Mian Yu. So we've got an upgrade for the... Uh, oh, hang on. Have I not done the upgrade? Let's have a look-see here. Uh, yeah, an upgrade. Unlock recipe. You have unlocked the recipe for caprice with pesto and balsamic cream. You need to make it at least once before you can add it to your menu. New ingredient uh, is now available on your shelves. Don't bother telling me what it is. I'll just work it out from, from what I'm looking at. It's, um, they're, uh, um, I don't know what they are. They, they could be nuts of some sort. I don't know. We'll have to figure it out later. So, oh, look at that. That does look rather good. That caprice. We're going to have a crack at that. Let's come in here. Let's get something new. What's really posh? That's level 14. We can't do that. Level 11. We can do a traditional pot au fait. Let's learn that. We have unlocked the recipe for a traditional pot au feu. Pot au feu. I don't know. You need to make it at least once before you can add it to your menu. <clears throat> Ooh, what the hell is that thing in the jar? Looks like some sort of ghoulish, um, uh, like a Halloween thing. The turnip. And is that bone marrow? Wow. I have, I have got some new interesting stuff to do. What does this do? ABC of risottos, three essential risotto recipes. You have unlocked the recipe for ABC of risottos. You need to make it at least once. Oh, you're kidding? Three classic pasta and so oh, this is uh, oh, a friend of mine's been doing this. He says the cheese sauce is an absolute nightmare. A couple of soup recipes I like. I like, I like, I like. What's this? Grilled languisti languistini, vegetable slices, shellfish sauce. Not really. Ooh, croque monsieur with two cheeses. That now that's right up my my alley. Yummy, yummy, yummy. What else have we got? Basque style chicken with cured ham. Ah, oh, see now, it's just making me hungry now. Game. God damn. Sautéed veal with olives and tomatoes. Yeah, not so much. That looks nice, though. Veal Milanese fresh garden salad. Hot diggity. Gonna bag it up. I like the way you work it. Hot diggity. Right, let's see what we can do today. My God, look how many things we've got now. Oh, I'm not panicking at all. So this morning, we've got new cookware as well. This morning, I'm going to try and practice some of those so we can put them in the shopping for t in the, God damn it, in the menu for tomorrow. Uh, might be, might be a good idea if I ordered some quality ingredients. Discount 25% if over five units. So we'll have a bit of that. Lovely stuff. Um, again. Oh, if over five. I see. <laughs> uh, you can't catch me out. I'm too smart for you. Right, so we get a 25% discount on both of those. Fantastic. Let's pay. Thank you so much. I've got five, 564 in the bank. We want to get to level 13. So that we can unlock and expand the restaurant. Um, do you know what? If, if I ordered tomorrow's ingredients today, then... Oh my god, this... Oh dear, I need to clean up. Yeah, if I ordered tomorrow's ingredients today, then I can get started in the morning straight away. What do you need? So let's go right ahead and do that. Take 
it so much. Now, that's interesting. If I reset her delivery, or is she just going to turn up twice? I think maybe she'll turn up twice, which is e even better, actually. That's more realistic. Motivated team, minus expenses. Responsibility goes up. The team are now more motivated because I've ordered high quality produce from a local resource. Oh, she ordered both lots immediately. Oh, that's that's interesting. She just added all the, she must have already had it on the truck. That's all I can. Yes. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh balls, I meant to change the menu. Never mind. Let's get some new items tested out here. We're gonna do the Caprice thing. I really all oh, pasta bolognese, that's my daughter's favourite. Put that on there. Pasta Italian, pasta with Italian cheese. This is what I want to try. A friend of mine said that making the cheese is an absolute nightmare, so let's test it. Uh... Caccio e pepe, yeah. I don't need any of those ingredients. So I need all of that. Oh, wait a minute. Perhaps I better read this flipping thing. This is going to be confusing. So I need spaghetti. Cooked industrial spaghetti. So I've got to get the pot hot and then just chuck it in. A bit of salt. Okay. Um, then the pepper and pecorino sauce. Uh, it's just basically chop up the cheese. And then I take the cheese in the water and that's what makes the sauce. And so the cheese goes in first, a bit of spices, a bit of pepper. And then mix it all together. Oh, I need a plating. Oh, no, 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 no details okay oh my god that is quite tricky yeah Thank you for telling me that. Uh, so let's turn that on. Let's get that up to, up to heat. Uh, guys, this place is disgusting. Good morning. Please help clean the restaurant. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Wow, we're in the afternoon already. That has come around really quickly. Um, so we put that down. It's boiling. salt and pepper missing a lot of salt perfect so I guess we could do the same thing with this and the beans We'll be keeping that up there, nice and warm. How many dishes, now that we know how to do this? Just one lot of spaghetti. Are you absolutely kidding me? I thought there'd be at least two lots in there. Why wouldn't you just make more spaghetti? That's, that's a bit daft. That is a bit daft. Uh, right, anyway, so I am going to need the spaghetti. So let's grab it. And uh, I think, what do we get? Is it a frying pan or a saucepan? Sauce Small saucepan with the cheese first. Okay, how do you count? Mm. 
Oh, you can now cover it. That's rather sweet. Right, so we'll put that in there. And then we'll cover it. I love this game. Uh, there are bits that annoy me, but I do love the game. Um, so do I need to cover it? I don't actually, oh, yes, I do need to cover it. So I've done the right thing. Okay, avoid heat too low. Remember to cover the food. Perfectly seasoned bonus. And then we just put the two things together. Superb. Perfect, guys. It's absolutely bloody perfect. You wouldn't believe it if I told you. Oh no, my spaghetti's gone cold. Oh, so I've ruined the spaghetti. Oh, it comes out. Wow, you get four dishes for that. That's quite a lot. Right, so they're both warm. They're both A+, plus, surprisingly. Bearing in mind I've just reheated it. Um, and I've forgotten again what sort of one I need. What do I need? I wish it would stay where I left it. Right, so I need the, the big old pan. I need this one. everything start the process so is it just a case of stirring it let's find out so at stage one avoid heat too high and remember to stir the food okay so I wish the menu would stay where it was to get our chefs on the go. It's halfway through the afternoon and I've got nothing prepped at all. But if I can serve this up then uh, it should be good. I think the restaurant's pretty clean. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, hang on. I got some. I got some markings down there for some stuff. Oh, I forgot to prep uh, the styling. Right, let's do it. So we're going to go with. So these are locked. Okay, so we'll go with the dark one. Uh, we don't really need that, do we? I quite like that bowl. I can't put that in there. Okay, so I don't need I don't need a bowl. What I do need. Ah, look at the swirl on that. I love that, and that's everything. Look, okay. How am I going to do the sauce? 
so I could just do boop, 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 boop. that's it bit of garnish it's all optional isn't it the garnish thank you chef That looks like saffron. Maybe not. Mm. Oh, no, cancel. I'm gonna get out of there. Can I drop it there? That's the one. Use this plating. Take a picture. Beautiful. Me likey. Okay. I love that. For some reason I can't serve the dish. Serve the dish. Take the dish. What do you mean by an unpretentious dish? How do I know if it's unpretentious? Right, guys, uh, we are in a bit of a sticky situation. I'm gonna need you to make everything. Oh, there's no point in you doing that, is there? Because it would just get deleted by the game. got just enough time to do all that we might as well go with it I suppose but they're gonna prep everything I can just uh, chillax maybe I can practice one of my other dishes one of my other new dishes Oops. so what else did I peep ah uh, yeah Caprice. Let's have a go at this. So, let's get the ingredients. Oh, blimey. Uses a lot of stuff. Let's have a look what it says here. So, we go to the blender. Oh, it's pine nuts. That's what they are pine nuts. Bunch of basil, parmesan, garlic, glass of olive oil. Someone's huffing and puffing at me, don't know why. That creates blended pesto. And then we've got to do a balsamic vinegar. We know how to do that, so that's kind of cool. We can keep that. Um, tomatoes, mozzarella and pesto. Right, let's, let's start with the blender thing. Demanding. Uh, okay, so that's very much a put it in there and leave it sort of situation. Prepare this dish beforehand to keep it in the refrigerator, okay, and then I've got to do the balsamic cream, I know how to do that. Then I've got to chop up mozzarella and, ah, seriously, seriously dude, what do you want? Kind of busy. Hi chef, how's it going? Everything running smoothly? Yep. 
It's tricky to focus on one task at a time. <laughs> it is, but people keep coming in. Dickhead. It's tricky to focus on one task at a time when there's so much to do. Here's an idea. Why don't you try focusing on the quality of service you offer? If you succeed in doing this, by telling my customers about your restaurant, it would give you it would give you a nice boost. Think about it. Why would another chef send his customers to us? That makes no sense whatsoever. So that's going to get ruined. Let's go up here. Beans. There's nothing in this one. Uh, all right, look at this. Pesto, baby. So now we need to, I think, prep this and this. I think we need slices. No, it's going to be a, a very stressful day, I fear. We're not going to get very good ratings because you two are going to do most of the cooking. All right, tell me, what have you prepped? Good, very good, well done. Right, see the quality of those is not very good. I'm not massively impressed at all. <coughs> I've got an A grade Cacio e Pepe there. It does look nice, doesn't it? But I can't serve it, I don't think. They're definitely getting faster, those two, aren't they? I wonder if perhaps you're meant to make them do stuff multiple times until they do it to the high enough quality. So I have the balsamic cream. Now I'm going to make this bad boy. That's pretty cool. So if I just serve this on time, then we'll have two new dishes for tomorrow. What goes with it? Oh, that goes with it. Okay, cool. Free plating. Can I just see what it looks like first and then see if I can upgrade it? Wow, changing the dish is like proper gonna spin my head out, isn't it? Uh, so that looks good. I think we'll stick with that. Don't need that. So what are we looking for here? What's the where's the main where's the main thing? Where's the food? Oh I see I can present it any way I like. Oh that is very clever. It's very clever. Alright. We'll start with a bit of that. locked. I can't have that one yet. There's a few there I can't have actually. I 
can only have one. No, it just sits on the top. That doesn't work. All right, that's not going to work the way I wanted it to. So, um, let's try putting a bit of this down first. I can put more than one down. Oh, well, in that case, let's just start with that. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, we're obviously lacking something. That's optional. So we don't have enough source if I go mm, mm. liking that so the pine nuts are optional I like the roasted pine What am I missing? Ah, uh, yes. Beautiful. Oh yeah, this with a bit of green. Green, 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 green. stuff is but yeah I'm liking that save plating use this plating take a picture show the name take a photo yeah that's not bad I don't know I think maybe their design actually look better than mine but whatever this is what we're doing um, surf dish oh I can actually serve that one why couldn't I serve the other one No idea. We don't understand anything enough just yet. Um, right. Put that down there. How long have we got? We got like literally minutes before the evening or the afternoon service or the evening service, I should say. So I'm hoping we got two dishes done there. Okay, that's the, that's the beans. We have so many dishes now. Is it that one? So it doesn't qualify as either of those. Okay. Right, evening service is up. 
let's just get all this put away. And that'll, that'll boost our um, morale and stuff. This is going to be a really tough service because I haven't prepped anything at all. I'm a bit nervous now. Depending on what gets ordered will very much dictate whether this is a success or complete failure today. Oh. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it. I'm so what have we got? We've got the soup. We've got two of those. We've got the meatballs prepped. Done. One last job. Just simply remembering what needs to be done is, is kind of the key thing, isn't it? Why don't you automatically go to the left where I've got some stuff that needs to be done, for goodness sakes. Right. Fingers crossed. Have we got... Oh, I haven't got any salad -y stuff, have I? Um, Adele, please, could you? Yeah, no, we've got that. No problem, Just get me that sorted out. Kasim, if you could focus on... We've got the fish, haven't we? Um, oops, what's going on there? Kind of got stuck. Um, a lemon season whipped butter. Just crack me up two of those. So we have, here we go, first dish. So I need his whipped buttery stuff. Uh, I need that back. Thank you. Need my cucumbers. It's just so silly that we can't put the uh, the fish into that when he's prepped it. I, I think they need to fix that personally. Uh, this one. Okay, so I think we might get away with this first dish. Service, please. It's not quite ready to flip. This is good. Very good, guys. Really impressed. Thank you very much. You're doing a fantastic job. We've got another one of those up there. If I take that and put it on there, then maybe I can heat it back up in a minute. Or maybe, maybe I can take it and put it over here. Oh, that works. Yeah, that works. All right. We'll, we'll rock and roll with that. The tomatoes and the beans. Don't know what that noise was. There we go. Whew. Quite stressful. Quite stressful. does look a bit of a mess, doesn't it? I'm going to have to fix that. That is not going to get me a Michelin star. 
You know what? I I suspect that lady there might be a, a chef of some sort, like a Michelin star typey chef. I've just served two dishes. Why is nobody eating? Roger. So. The pan. Whack it down. What do we need here? We need bread. No. Nope. We need that and parsley. Oh, and garlic and onion. Uh, of course. Garlic and onion. We'll do it ourselves today, but normally I would get my chef to help me. And now, boom, boom, boom. Back. Oh, nuggets! I didn't know we had a new uh, garlic chopping technique. So I just chopped it up wrong. Let me fix that. To be fair, I think because this was the first thing we learned how to do, crush the garlic, that should always be the first option because otherwise you're just going to make mistakes at some point. It's impossible almost not to. Right. Meatballs are in. Adele, please prep me the following. Thank you. Enough salt or black pepper. Let's get something to fix that problem. Perfect. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. Right, so we're all over this. We are all over this. They actually eating now. Nope. They have left the building. Customers are arriving. Voila! That still looks cool. Right. So there's not really much else I can do. Um, I'm going to get rid of this. And this, because they're not supposed to be uh, in my pocket. really like it if these could automatically filter down to the to the left what's the order okay Kasim get me a lemon season whipped butter on the go and have everything else I need I 
Oh god. That's not what I meant to do. That's the one. We got a very good result out of that, but uh, anyway. Oh, I've got one on the thing, I forgot. Forgot I had one here. Bomb. Uh, I just cooked the wrong thing. Oh man, this game does not get on top of you sometimes. You're like, so much to think about. So I'll just take that then and stick that up here. And that keeps everything pretty much ticking over quite nicely. I need to flip it. No, 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 I can hear you. To perfection. Am I cooking that too hot? Maybe that's what that's, that sign is. You think I'm cooking it too hot? I'm gonna have to read the, uh, I'm gonna have to read the, uh, the menu, the uh, recipe again. Ah, oh, flipping beans. Something's rated C, which is not very good. It's not going to be a good grade at all. Holy cow. Okay, well, we can get this out instantly, which is very cool. What the hell am I doing? Let's do the meatballs first. Make sure they go out nice and hot. A plus. Service, please. go with it, mademoiselle. Right. Hundred and one, uh, another loyal customer, service finished, 101 points. Oh, that's not as good as I was hoping for. I think what we're going to have to do is, is get our chefs cooking these dishes over and over and over again until they get to the quality that we feel is good enough. But um, two, six, nine, nine heads we did today. Good service. Not great, but good. 65, 85, one of the dishes was good. That's not too bad. Not too bad at all because I didn't prep it, it's because I didn't make it, I think, that we don't get 20 out of 20. Actually, we got very good scores for the meatballs there, so why didn't we get 100% there? Because it wasn't A+. Why wasn't it A+, I wonder?
but that orange carrot and mint consomme is absolutely awful. We're gonna have to just get um, our chefs practicing on these dishes. Oh, hello. We don't normally get someone coming in to say hi after service. Let's see what she wants. The plating was a huge hit. Engagement for my followers is super high. Well done. And this is just the start. I know our little collab will attract loads of new customers for you. Oh, cool. Well, she was impressed. That went well. I didn't actually notice her come in, but maybe that's why I kept hearing those noises. Yes, a pretty decent go. Um, so guys, I just thought I'd mention, um, in case you're wondering why the videos aren't going up every single day, it's because um, there's too much to do. Um, I can't possibly make a video every day. So are we gonna put them up every sort of three days, something like that? Um, and if nobody's watching, if there's not a lot of following, we'll, we'll swap it to once a week. Oh, dear me. But I am enjoying playing, so uh, there is that. And hopefully you're enjoying watching, hopefully. So, uh, oh yeah, that's lucky. Almost missed that. I think everything is cleaned and put away. Fairly decent service. Bear in mind I haven't played much recently. And you really do need to sort of have prepped a dish a few times in a row to really sort of be on top of it. But uh, that, I think that went quite well overall. Not too bad at all. Yeah. We've got some new dishes possibly for tomorrow. Um, maybe change up the uh, the, um, the menu. Oh, look at that. We're nearly level 13. We can nearly expand the, um, the restaurant as well. That looks nice. What's that? Traditional steak tartare, egg and homemade French fries. That looks lovely. I'll take my KXP points and I want to keep them for something here. A few green vegetables perhaps. All right, that's it for me. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Goodbye for now.